Hi, and welcome to Budget with Tiffany. I'm Tiffany. I'm so excited to have you here today. I'm going to be doing my third, no, second cash unstuffing for the month of June. Um, always throws me off because like it's going into the third week, but I'm unstuffing for the week before. But before I jump into that, I wanted to quickly share, I announced on Monday as part of our mini Mondays um, that Becca and I, Becca from Becca Budget 777 and I are doing a collaboration for our Road to 500 subscribers. We're both getting so close. We're like 340 something as of when I'm recording this. Um, so we put together kind of a joint collaboration. You'll just have to go uh, into my description to download mine and into her, uh, go to her channel and get hers in her description. Uh, so for hers, we're doing, I apologize, this is still black and white because um, I didn't have access to a color printer when I printed hers, but she has this, all I want for Christmas is, Christmas is my two front teeth. So, which is super cute. I thought this was just adorable when she created it and shared it with me. Um, so yeah, so go grab hers. And then mine is this, wish, we wish you a meowy Christmas. Uh, so both of these can be used for, you know, mini Mondays or if you have like a Christmas binder or something. So yeah, love it if you would subscribe to both of our channels if you aren't already. Love it if you shared uh, with others on your channel if you have one um, and you're already subscribed and help us reach our goal of hitting 500. Uh, we kind of cheesily said, you know, it'd be Christmas in July if we were able to reach 500 subscribers before the end of July. So we would love it if uh, you could help us um, reach that goal. So, well, anyway, um, Let's look at our, my husband and my finances and our uh, expenses for the second week of June. How is everybody doing today? I am filming this. This is Friday the 21st. Um, I usually like to film several videos on Friday before the weekend gets going and things get busy. Uh, so I hope you guys, I guess by the time you see this, this will be Tuesday when I upload or publish this. So I hope you guys are having a good week. Um, can't believe it's going to be the last week of, like full week of June. Um, so yeah. So our expenses were not too bad this last week, um, nothing too out of the ordinary, uh, but let's jump in first to our kind of monthly variable binder. Um, so let's see, go to groceries, kind of had our normal uh, $14 at Target, so I'll take 20 and give myself back six. And then I had um, 53 at Aldi. Take that 55 and give myself back two. And then I grabbed a couple things at the co op um, for $8. So take that and give myself back 12. So now we've got 10, 12, 14, $15 left over. And then up next, we've got spending. I bought a new planner on Amazon. I wasn't really liking the planner that I'd been using for the first half of the month. So I bought a new planner. So that ended up being, I had a credit um, from some other things that I had returned. So it ended up just costing me $8. So it was $10. In and I'll give myself two back. So we've got 20, 35, 37. And I know a lot of people probably, or I feel like a lot of people who are budgeting people are also planner people. 
And so I decided to get a Hobonichi Techo uh, cousin. Um, I've been want, kind of wanting to get one for a while and I took some of the stickers that people have been sending me with my orders or freebies, um, you know, giveaways and stuff and um, put those on here along, along with some other stickers. So um, yeah, so I'm gonna be using this starting in July. I'm really excited. Um, and then lastly, out of this binder, I had uh, several different things for toiletries. I returned a couple things at Target. Um, what did I return? I can't even remember. Something for $12, so I'll give myself back 10, 12. So what happens when film these like a week after you do whatever you forget what it was that you did so and then at Target I bought a bunch of toiletries I got some mouthwash for me and my husband we like different mouthwash so I had to get two I got some hand soap and some toothpaste and a couple other things so that ended up being uh $34 so 20 35 get myself back one and then um, I have a Sonic electronic toothbrush. And if you register with them, you can get a um, new uh, toothbrush head for your thing. And the first time I was able to get a free one. And then now it's going to be like $9 with after tax and stuff to get a new one, which when I compared that to what I was paying to get like three of them uh, that I would use over the course of, you know, nine months because you replace the toothbrush head every three months, it was actually a little bit cheaper and it comes in the mails and so it makes my life easier. So that got charged and I'll get that for the beginning of July. So that was $10 and so I'll give myself back one. So that gives me 10, 12, 13, 14, 15, and that is it for that binder. And then got a couple things for our kitties. Um, I bought some litter. We have two litter boxes, and so just as it gets low, I buy to replace. Um, so I end up being $19 and so I'll take 20 and give myself back one. And then so that gets us $22 left in litter. So that's enough for one more. And then for medicine, I've got Cusa's medicine last week and that ended up being uh, $59, so I've got 50, 65, $69. So I'll take 50, 5, 56, 57, 58, 59, and leave the 10. And that is it for that binder. And then lastly, in our long term savings uh, sinking funds, we have uh, my husband did a donation to our local Minnesota Firefighters Association, and so that was $25. So take 25 and I'm taking that from opportunities, just don't really feel like it was a good place to take it from. So we got 500, 600, 700, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, so $765, which is correct. And then I bought um, just some t-shirts at Target. I realized that a lot of my kind of just day-to-day -day hang out at home t-shirts and stuff were getting holes in them and stuff and because I wear them, you know. Not that I wear them a ton, especially now that I'm back working at the office, but you know, I've had a lot, a lot of them for, you know, 10 or more years. So um, they've 
they've had their share of love and so I wanted to kind of just pick up some basic t-shirts that I could wear and I saw at Target that they had um end up picking up three of the same shirt in three different colors so um that ended up being $30 and I don't have 30 so I'll take 100 and give myself back 50 70 so we should have 150 70 92 192 which is correct tended with the fact that I was pre-COVID, I would wear dress clothes five days a week, you know, black pants and, or, you know, dress pants and then a nice shirt five days a week. And so I hardly ever wore regular t-shirts. And then during COVID, I pretty much wore pajamas most days because I wasn't barely leaving the house and, or, you know, I would wear pajamas during the work day and then, you know, maybe put on something in the afternoon if I was running errands or something, but definitely wasn't wearing as much. And then since the return to office, um, I can generally wear jeans to work, which is probably good because I put on weight and I can't actually fit into several of my dress pants anymore. Um, so now I can generally wear jeans into the office and then I wear dress shirts for the top. And then, so yeah, so my weekend you know day-to-day -day shirts kind of haven't really gotten as much love because i hardly spent much money on those so wanted to kind of build that up a little bit now that several of them were getting holes and stuff so well that is it for the unstuffing so let's make sure that i have the right amount of money so i set 70 dollars aside to start to make change and our total is $247. So we have 120, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 200, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47. 247 dollars. So glad, always happy when that works out. Uh, so that is the, it for the this video. I hope you enjoyed. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Don't forget to get um, the freebies. Um, I've got my 100 subscriber and my 200 subscriber, or no, 200 subscriber and 300 subscriber freebies. And then uh, I've got my freebie for the collaboration with Becca from Becca Budget 777 down in my description. It's a link to a Google Drive um, or Google Doc Drive um, that has all of them. So don't forget to go get those and yeah, and subscribe and help us reach our goal of 500 subscribers. Thank you so much. See you in the next video.